straight back. Right, for and then you go with Julia. Julia keeps going. Then go with Julia. Okay. One of Hollywood's highest acclaimed female stars is embarking on the most daring portrayal of her career in a new motion picture, Dying Young. I have leukemia. Do you know anything about chemotherapy? Well, I know it's a treatment for... Well, I need help during it. Want the job? She's taken this job and, and she discovers, uh, kind of much to her horror, that she is completely, completely not prepared for this drama. I wish I knew how to care for him, but I don't. He needs some nerves. I don't think I can deal with it. Joining Julia Roberts on Dying Young is the man who directed her in the popular Flatliners, Joel Schumacher. That my palm. I just don't think there's anybody like her because she uh, has a phenomenal range and um, the young woman that she plays in this movie has to experience everything. You want me to tell you I love you? You can say, well, great, well, now I'm going to die and I'm going to leave. For producer Sally Field, Julia Roberts has from the very beginning been the only choice for the role of Hillary. It's a role that, that Julia could bring to life like um, no one else that I could think of. Um, so I always, in my mind, I developed this for Julia. I got a call from Sally Field, who's producing this, who told me the story and uh, sent me the script. And There was no way for me to even be able to ponder not, not doing it. You read it and you, you have to be a part of it. Do you really want to have some fun? Julia's character, Hilary O'Neill, finds herself falling in love with Victor, a wealthy young man played by Campbell Scott. The great thing about Julia's character and the way she does it, too, is that it's very, it's very slow and very confused, and yet you, you see it happen, that she, uh, not only is she helping someone else, but she is blossoming as a person herself. Tell me why. Because, because I am afraid. Afraid of what? Of hoping can't let you give up. Dying Young, a celebration of life and enduring romance. I love you, Hillary. And I don't want you to leave. I know the sweetness in you. And I know that you've changed me. And I'm going to say thank you. I won't leave you. I don't think you can go through something like this and not be changed forever in some way. This is a movie about sort of appreciating life while we have it to portray it as, as more precious because it is not going to be very long.